So being stung by a toxic or stinging caterpillar in the state of Missouri is less likely than in other states in the U.S., partially because outbreaks of these type of caterpillars are less likely than in other states. However, it can occasionally happen. In addition, there are about a thousand caterpillar species in Missouri and only 15 of those are considered stinging or toxic. This is the flannel moth, widely considered the top of the list since there are so many nasty side effects associated with its sting, possibly even leaving you in the ER. They come in several colors and the stinging hairs are hidden within. Side effects from touching them are redness, welts, swelling, nausea, fever, and burning pain. On the bright side, this is the cute fuzzy moth they turn into. This is the hag moth and it is likely the creepiest of the stinging caterpillars. It doesn't even look like a caterpillar. So try to contain your temptation to touch as the reaction can include burning, stinging, redness, swelling, and inflammation. And the moth, of course, is harmless and fuzzy. This is the stinging rose caterpillar and they pack quite a punch. They can give you a terrible sting that can last for hours or days, but hopefully due to its bright colors, you will notice it before running into it. I also found this nice descriptive graph which shows how the spines will break off and lodge into your skin. Is not as colorful, they are kind of cute and completely harmless. Next up is the saddleback caterpillar, and it's easy to run into these guys by accident because they like blueberry bushes and fruit trees, which people are often trying to harvest fruit from. Uh, if you brush up against one of these accidentally, what you will feel is like you are on fire rather than a sting. It is an intense burning pain with swelling and welts, and it can last for quite a few days. And again, fuzzy, harmless, cute adult moth. So finally, we come to the buck moth caterpillar, which should be pretty obvious that you shouldn't touch it. It is loaded with spikes all around. However, if you do, you can be sure that you're going to feel radiation of pain to local lymphatic groups, followed by itching, redness, swelling, and welts, raised skin that can remain visible for 24 hours to a week. But the moth it turns into is quite a beauty. Now, just a side note, the hickory horn devil is also found in Missouri, but they are completely harmless, the largest caterpillar in the world, and they're really fun to hold.